Okay, it's time to deliberately fall down the hole. Uh, unless I've missed... well... Here's hoping I haven't. Well, that's a little good catching it now. <sighs> Runes! Runes and diagrams. Hello, you. Fun compound symbols. Uh, oh, and you, of course. Here you are to be helpful. Ah, but there's spiky objects I can actually kill you with here. Let me take one. Thank you. I'm so sick of spiky objects not being an option. There's more spikes I can take. Just in time to catch both souls. Lovely. Um. Ah, yes. Yes, indeed, Liwoo Liwoo. Now. Here's the, here's the hand that bites your ass. Um. I've completely forgotten what the symbol was I was looking at. Okay, so if it's a Z, it's the Holy Hand Grenade. If it's an N, it's a triangle. And if it's a crucifix, it's you. It's an N, it's a triangle. Okay. Uh... The crucifix is you. It is somewhat alarming that I've actually successfully remembered it like that, but... You know, if, if it expedites the process, well, that leaves nothing. No, no recourse for you but the holy hand grenade. Oh, you're swinging objects now? You swinging the thing above me? Are you swinging the thing above every anyone else? Not everyone else. We'd notice. You are. You're literally swinging things everywhere I look. Well, which thing do I want, though? What's what's the most important thing to have in moments like these? Is it? Oh, maybe maybe there's just a switch at the top of all of them that I need to. Yes, now I know why the door's in an odd position. You see, these, this is all stuff you can figure out. It's all perfectly sane and reasonable. Even if you do judder un disconcertingly on some of the moving platforms. Might actually behoove me to take one of these with with me. It's triangle. Because it's just occurred to me that I don't have my fun. Oh, it, it's not that I'm falling off. It's that my shins are disappearing. Different problem. There we go. You see, now it's off. Moved off to the other path, and we're all better off. Unless you're a goth. This has been my poetry. Please donate five thousand pounds to me at once. Ah, ah, the spiraling ramps. It's difficult to know because we're in the final stretch now. There's no like this is the only objective we have to achieve at this point. Just go deeper into the thing. It's difficult to know how to split this up. Like for example, um. Ever since having entered into the caves in the first place, I don't know at time of recording if you will have seen two 20 minute episodes or one 40 minute episode. Because I don't know, I don't know, there's, the, the cut off points aren't as clear as they once were. 
Oh, space and time. What? You're making a decision for me that space is wiggling. I can see into your mind. Oh, shit. This is this is us complaining to the octopus about having brought us back from the dead. My arrival in this miserable age. What trickery is this? It is no illusion, Raziel, but a glimpse into the currents of time itself. Oh, so that's not a portal anywhere. That's just that's just a looky. That's just a look me see. But yeah, so that, that's just to say that I'm just to sort of vent my frustration really that I don't know how to divide this section of the game up into episodes because weirdly enough, uh, in in this time themed area, I have lost all concept of it. So, you know, I, I sort of just keep going and the recording goes longer for than I might have expected as we go through the winding corridors of serpents. Another glimpse. Another glimpse into time. What reveals will you make happen with your squiggly space creatures? Eh? What do you plan to do? Hit me with a sword. The important moments. All the greatest hits. These apparitions torment me. Has this all been foretold? Yes. Yes. You 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 do you do know what the guy who lived here did for a living, right? You do remember? You delivered a whole monologue? Yeah. Puff! I was hoping I could strike in midair. I don't know why I thought you could do that all of a sudden. Who's this winged fuck with two pirate swords? It's the flying pirate of Nosgoth. The flying pirate of Nosgoth has come to save us. I, for one, am thrilled. That's becoming sort of a catchphrase, and I'm, I kind of wish it wouldn't, because it's sort of upsettingly cynical. More spacey wiggles. Oh no! That's when I found out I was a boy. Impossible! This must be one of Kane's deceptions. You've seen it done twice. It's very possible. Kane has somehow... He set up cameras. That's what Kane has done. He set up cameras and has displayed the footage on the fabric of the universe? Sorry, it, it, some, it's one of those moments. I've been read, I've been reading a lot of Lovecraft recently, and my tolerance for the protagonist not picking up on something that is obvious to the observer has waned, shall we say? It, it has certainly been taxed to a degree that we would perhaps rather it hadn't been. Gah. Wiggly. Plankton. And everything that goes with it. This hasn't happened. My mind reels with conflict. 
does Cain await me moments from now? Or in some century yet to come? It's the future, that one. That one was the future that happened. Or will happen, because it's the future. Told you I was losing all concept of time. I've got a stick though still, so you can't hold that against me. More pirate. More pirate murals. Shirtless pirate murals, come get your wings. Join the X-Men. That was the Angel was in X-Men, right? Came the Archangel. Had metal wings through a uh, uh, some sort of deal with Apocalypse that I never quite grasped. I do, I do, I think, still own the issue where he gets his normal wings back. In some continuity that has long since been extinguished, anyway. Ghost! This cannot be. What madness does this scene portend? Cain must think me credulous to suffer these lies. Oddly enough, that doesn't actually happen. A, a version of that, to their credit, does happen eventually. But it was cut from this game. Because you may recall me mentioning there were going to be other kinds of Reaver uh, beside the fire one that you could have. That's again going to come up in the documentary, I'm sure. In fact, I've seen some of the forges. But, uh... Yeah, to their narrative credit, some version of what we just saw does kind of happen. Nowhere near that. But that's, you know, they didn't they didn't forget entirely. We do get an aerial imbued reaver. Eventually. And that, that one was kind of a long... A long sausage. What's in this one? What fun creatures await. Now this never happens. We never get that. Is this phantasm a conjuration of my mind? Or an echo of future events. We never stand in a corridor with a, a black and red reaver. Unless that was going to be in a, a sequel that never came out, but there's... There's reasons for me to doubt that. Yeah, those, those, those are some, some hints at things that were supposed to have been in the game but weren't. And I don't know if they were left in deliberately as a sort of, oh, look what you could have won, or or if the implication is it's parallel timelines, or if they just didn't take it out. They were supposed to and either forgot or ran out of time. Who knows? We don't know. We're only Jill Valentine from one of the Resident Evil games. The first one? Because the sec- yeah, Resident Evil 2 was Claire Redfield. This is completely irrelevant. Here we live in Great Spans. Great Spans! For you, and everyone who's still alive. Ooby dooby doo, hey yeah. I'm gonna want that back though. I just threw it because I thought it would be fun to throw something. Um, what am I? Yes. I lost track of the layouts of rooms for a moment there and was very confused. Um, yeah, we keep going down. 
down, down, down through the rooms that have portraits of marble surfaces. What's the what's the theme here? Oh, help me! I've been squished. You've been very squished. I don't know what's going on there. Aha! As we stutter towards the final confrontation. I must say I'm disappointed in your progress. I imagined you'd be here sooner. Tell me, did it trouble you to murder your brothers? Did it trouble you when you ordered me into the abyss? And no. killed all of my clan, I let's not forget. In, you. in your ability to hate, in your self-righteous indignation. Lies. You cannot have foreseen all of this. Eternity is relentless, Raziel. When I first stole into this chamber centuries ago, I did not fathom the true power of knowledge. To know the future, Raziel. To see its paths and streams tracing out into the infinite. As a man, I could never have contained such forbidden truths. But each of us is so much more than we once were. Gazing out across the plains of possibility, do you not feel, with all your soul, how we have become like gods? And as such, are we not indivisible? As long as a single one of us stands, we are legion. And that is why. So you see, it didn't matter that I exterminated your entire bloodline. I can do so with a clear heart. Very poor. No, it is literally said it. In the end. You offer no more than a convenient rationalization for your crimes. Yeah. Yeah, you, you've nailed it, really. Offer insight for those patient enough to look. In your haste to find me, perhaps you have not gazed deeply enough. Our futures are predestined. Mobius foretold mine a millennium ago. We each play out the parts fate has written for us. We are compelled ineluctably down preordained paths. So now my you argument is I had no choice. An illusion. I have been to the tomb of Seraphan Cain. Your dirty secret is exposed. How my nudes! Transform a Seraphan priest into a vampire. They f one of them finally How fucking moved. Not? One must keep his friends close, Raziel, and his enemies. Even closer. Can you grasp the absurd beauty of the paradox? We are the same. Seraphan and vampire. With our holy wars, our obsession with Nosgoth's domination, who better to serve me than those whose passion transcends all notions of good and evil? I will not applaud your clever blasphemy. The Seraphan were saviors. Defending Nosgoth from the corruption that we represent. What are you My basing that on? Cain, I find no nobility in the unlife you rudely forced on my unwilling. You're just course. saying that because you've discovered he's you bad. That does not make them past, good. But you know nothing of it. You think the Seraphan were noble? Altruistic? <laughs> Don't be simple. Their agenda was the same as ours. What you if are both sides are just as bad? Relativism, Cain. These apparitions and portents. What game are you playing now? Destiny is a game, is it not? And now, you are waiting. I've heard destiny's gone really downhill, actually. Yeah. So there's. All right. Ah! We've been zapped. Where's the man running off from? Oh. I want a bunch more health, please. You've got lightning. You've got lightning and I don't want you to have. God, I've hit you with this. You don't chuckle at my stick. Chuckle at me hitting you with a stick? So, ow! Oh, you've not, you've not ascended to the upper floors yet. You're just leering at me. 
Oh, I know why you're chuckling at my stick and haven't ascended to the upper floors. My stick is irrelevant. And the reason that I have a health thing at all is because I need you this to thwip you with. Give you a good whack with a spectral sword. If I can bloody find you. Boss fight difficulty. Achieved by not knowing where the bloody hell your opponent is. He just did a little yay. Lightning turns the object. Spinning the grabber. We will win a prize. I hear these things are rigged. I mean, they are rigged. Like, that's, that's beyond question at this point. The outcome is preordained, much like Destiny. I guess that's why there's one in here, to sort of illustrate that point. Crane games are really just lessons in fatalism. You got my nipples! So yeah, that, that, that sort of... You know, the world has not been kind to my opinions of, you know, some of the narrative that happens in this yeah. game. Mostly because this is a universe in which the both sides-isms actually apply. Rather than, you know, one side... Literally be with being willing to let billions of people just fucking... Perish. Burning down their entire homes. Sorry, I, I, got, I get really depressed thinking. I'm genuinely quite depressed thinking about it, but... And, and then, of course, the other side. How dare they? Wanting to have free healthcare and maybe not be called slurs. Truly, the, the, the moral lines are so grey on both sides. But yeah, th this, is, this is essentially the universe they all think they're living in when they say, well, maybe you shouldn't condemn us because what if you're bad? They all, they all think they're a vampire in the time streamer's chamber shooting lightning at you while you're not sure where they are. get you in time, but I'm bloody well gonna run at you. They do kind of try to ad address this imbalance. What? That sentence apparently just doesn't want to happen, so I'm gonna abandon it. Where do you live? Behind me somewhere. Ow, how am I meant to get up to you in time? I feel like I've basically just got to pick a direction and hope he turns up there. And he didn't. Although I do get the feeling he was at least nearby. I don't, I don't know how I'm supposed to go back to the Reaver getting place discern your location and then get up there in the kind of time you're asking me to do it. I think I saw him. I completely didn't see him. You're over there. I will never reach you. Sometimes the lightning misses. No, I didn't. Um. Oh, he's right across from me. I don't know how you missed, but you did, and I'm gr and you would be just the worst place for me to try and reach you, wouldn't you? I'm feeling an imbalance. The, dy the dynamic here does not feel... It's a bit one-sided. I don't know if he actually ever appears by the, the levers. What if I do a... Is there a late-game shift that I can manage? 
my thinking being is that perhaps there's there's no shifty portals up at the top. Unfortunately, because that, that was my thinking. Maybe I'm supposed to, like, sort of shift up to the top level and catch him unawares in that manner. You need to not. If you could bring yourself to. If you could bring yourself to sort of look at this from my perspective for a second and realise that you're not being terribly helpful. Oh, that's actually making it significantly quicker. If I could not do that ever again. Well, there's nothing to do now but just wait for the next zap. Yeah. What are you doing standing still? I didn't press the stand still button. I pressed the move your ass button. You didn't move your ass, you didn't move anything. Do you not think this is agonizing enough for me already. We're so close to the end and yet you're so unwilling to do something for me here. Then you've pulled that right through! Right. Is there some sort of pattern to how we... What's... What's your pattern? What's, what's, how do you... How do you justify yourself? What? I didn't even see a boy. Oh, so he was on that one. He's now on that one. Okay. So he was on that one. And now... And now he's just fucking nowhere. He's not loading in, but that's what that's supposed to be the, the function that the big light serves is to let you know he's still around. Why would you appear on the one that I can't do anything about? <sighs> There's gotta be another way of doing this, surely. Surely there's a method of actually making this achievable. Can I at least dodge the lightning somehow? But no. You've 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 gone back there. I'm trying to hop. This is agony. This is blood. Do it. Do it, you idiot. Yes. Okay. That's the last phase, thankfully, I think. Because now he's spun his thing a lot, and it's really going. You nearly had me, Raziel. But this is not where, or how, it ends. Fate promises more twists before this drama unfolds completely. You already own the sequel. <laughs> <laughs> Awkwardly shuffles. Be warned, Raziel. Once you cross this threshold, you are beyond my influence. I don't know that that necessarily comes as a discomfort. Infinity. Or eight, we don't know. Raziel, oh. Redeemer and Destroyer, Pawn and Messiah, welcome, time span soul. Welcome to your destiny. You look like a lot, a lot. Then happen. Where time Final is line of the fucking a series, and I fucked it up that badly. Cloth. A streamer might seize upon a chance, a fatal slip, 
and plunge the fate of planets into chaos. He likes string, and he's going to fuck up your shit. To be continued! Oh, Now let's have a look at some concept art. Well, that's... That's Soul Reaver 1! And I... I really... I just lost complete control over all mode of speech at the end there. After running around a room trying to hit a boy fruitlessly for a long time. What a weird way to end. You know, as climatic, climactic battles go, you know, it, it is PS1 era, so I do bear that in mind, but like, like this is a weird ending and I don't know what to do with myself now. There's the human tower of time wasting. As a human boy scared of pillars. <sighs> so no, it's another one. This, this is a big one as well. Now fully recorded. I've got I've got this one locked down. Jim Curry. A bit like Tim Curry, but less so. Just less of Tim Curry. A smaller Tim Curry. About two thirds of the size. Tony J's in it. Tony J was Zephon as well. Huh. You know, you know, like thinking back to what Zephon sounded like, that actually kind of makes sense. You've got no nose. Looks a bit like the 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 fish guy from a uh, Hellboy. Why does the name Billy Mitchell concern me? I saw the name Billy Mitchell and then and it set off some sort of horrifying recognition and it might just be that I've mistaken him for someone else, but... I don't know. It's not worth looking into. There's a skull that's fallen over. What more do you want? So... Obviously, I'm going to do Soul Reaver 2. I don't know how immediately I'm going to get on that, but... Steve Grohl! Wasn't he a drummer? What was he doing here? What's... The Crunch. Nah. That's a shame. That's a shame to see. Ah. Uh. Well, I mean, we know that a bunch of stuff got cut out, so it was... You know, cl clearly there were time difficulties and whatnot, so I, I guess it's... It should it should have been no secret to me that Crunch was involved, but it's still sad to see. Don't Crunch, everyone. Like, un under any circumstances, I guarantee you there are other options, and if there aren't, you've already fucked up. Uh. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Uh. Um, Mr. Coffee, don't ha ever happen. <laughs> I'm willing to bet there was also a Mrs. Donut, so I'm willing to bet it's not the Mr. Coffee we're all thinking of. Number 50, for the strength he will always bring. What, what, were these experiments? Were these test subjects that you... The Snake Pit and the Extended Snake Pit. These are... I'm, I'm, I'm willing to bet that these are just, you know, cute nicknames for ordinary people, but they are still delightful. Or maybe I'm just in one of those moods, because I am, like, I'm clearly babbling, you may have noticed. I don't, I don't really know why I wanted to let the credits run to the end there, just sort of out of respect for the game, I guess, but... 
yeah, Legacy of Kane Soul Reaver. Tune in next time for something else, and tune in eventually for Soul Reaver 2. Uh... Well, the ending of this one kind of snuck up on me. Huh. Take care, everyone.